of a better way to start than with a blessing of our new facility, I'd like to uh, welcome Rabbi Slavin to just come up from the Miriam Robin Hebrew School to say a blessing for us. Please join us. Thank you very much. It's a really an honor and a pleasure to be able to be here today and to start this special morning and the dedication of this special location uh, with a prayer and a blessing. Mishaberach avoteinu Abraham Yitzchak v'Yakov. Hu yivarech et kol hacholim beha Credit Valley Hospital. Bavur shebli neder yitnu tztaka bavuram. Blize hakadosh baruchu yirape otam berefua shlema v'nomar amen. May the one who blessed Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Sarah, Rebecca, Rachel, and Leah, bless all of those that are here at the Credit Valley Hospital that are in need for a special blessing for better health. And may he bless all those that are here today as doctors, physicians, and those that are supporting um, the special um, hospital, the Credit Valley Hospital. And may God bless them with all of the blessings needed with peace, happiness, and joy, and let us all say, Amen. The expansion of this hospital and this part of the hospital uh, began about five years ago. And it was a vision that grew from the, the demand and the, the increased need in our community. A vision that was centered on the delivery of safe, quality, and patient-centered care right here at home. Increasing Credit Valley size by almost one-third when we open this wing, we'll move from 382 beds to 471 when it's fully operational. And this positions us very well for the future and the changing needs of our very diverse and very fast growing population. It is more than just the physical today, the physical building. It is much more than that. And as we, we look at the different areas and we've reached completion, We've been able to do this in a very planful way, in a phased way. So, although we're opening today, we've been slowly opening for the last year. When you think about our expanded laboratory services, our genetic counseling services, and our endoscopy clinic, rehabilitation services, and mental health care areas, all of these over the last year have been slowly opening to our, st our staff who have moved into these new areas and to the public who now are able to receive care. And you know, it was only a few years ago that we set a very ambitious goal. And the goal was to raise $45 million so that this hospital could expand to better serve our growing population. And you know, we've made it happen and we've done just that. And I want you to applaud yourself. Congratulations, you've done a remarkable job. And it's so exciting to be cutting the ribbon and seeing this vision that we all had so many years ago become a reality. And it is because of you. It is because of your support. It is because of a vibrant, compassionate, and very empowered community. 